Hey everyone, wanted to do a quick demo. This is an Akai GX266-2 or II. And I think I've even seen it say it's an MK2. Um, but whatever. Uh, six head glass crystal ferrite heads. I just went through all this, replaced the uh, the fault prone uh, transistors. I, I clean. I disassembled the linkages and cleaned them. I didn't just oil the linkages. Um, I mean, this thing I had torn down and cleaned them and re-lubricated and re-greased what needed to be greased and so on. Cleaned all the pots and the switches with uh, deoxid, two types of deoxid, the, the D5, the cleaner, and then I let that dry overnight and then I, um, you know, put the fader lube in there. Uh, works pretty good. Let's do a little record demo here. Radio in the background. And who I am. That's what's coming off of the tape. That's the radio going onto the tape. And that's coming off the tape. This is a full automatic reverse. Hit the sensing foil. Now it's recording in the opposite direction. So I can record an entire tape, front to back and, and on up the other side, uh, without, you know, paying a whole lot of attention to it. It's pretty cool. Alright, let's hear what we did. In this model, I have only seen it on this model, but uh, it, it's pretty cool. The uh, for the counter, the uh, numbers are green, green pointer, green pointer, green pointer. The uh, the meters not only are the needles green as well, but the the light in there is kind of a tinge of green. Uh, this, this thing will do a wide range tape or a low noise tape. It, do, it does two speeds, three three quarters and seven and a half. And these are seven inch reels. And it has these cool twist locks on there also. So if you're not familiar with those, those are golden. You don't have to use those goofy rubber stoppers that you can never find when you want to do something. What else? Let's see. This uh, I have. I had uh, how it auto reversed. I had uh, sensing foil on the uh, back side of the tape, at the end of the tape, as you can see. This this has a reverse selector, so you can either play one side straight through, and it'll and it'll uh, it'll stop. This setting you could make it reverse, play the one side, reverse, and then play the other side, or record. And then there's this setting here. If you have sensing foil at the beginning of the tape, this thing will play one side, hit the foil, play the other side, all the way to the other end, and hit the foil and start over again. And it'll do that, and you know, until you until you turn it off. It'll go back and forth a thousand times if you let it. The, uh, the tension arms, I put this in the listing. This is the original, this is one of the original tension arms. This is not. The length is the same, but the little cone on the end, this is actually taller than this one. <sighs> the case is a little bit beat up on this one. There's, uh, there's some laminate missing right here, and I just kind of darkened the wood a little bit. So it didn't look so bad, but uh, the wooden side panels aren't that great. But you can actually um, 
They're seven and a half inches wide, has all the original screws, so people that want to uh, do something with wood, you can really make some nice panels out of oak or, you know, what, whatever flavor wood you want to. One touch. So anyways, there you have it, Akai GX266II. Thanks for looking, I appreciate it.